Hello everyone, I am Ashley Pinson, the Dixieland Oki. I am a stay-at-home mom with two boys in an online business where I create digital products to make your life easier and more beautiful. And today I'm going to show you the grocery prices tracker template that I have um, for Notion. So this is something that has saved me um, a lot of money um, comparing prices in the grocery store. So, um, I used to do this on a spreadsheet. Um, this actually works a lot better. There's a couple of functions that I absolutely love about this. So let's dive in and see what it does. So here you just have your item, the price, the number of units, the price per unit is calculated for you. The type of unit. So here we have ounces, pounds, you can do each. You can edit this and add to this property if you want to. Store that the price is at. Again, you can add a store if I don't have it in the list for you, but I did cover the, the basics, I think. Um, this, whether or not it is a sale price. I like to know if the price I recorded was a special sale or if it was um, a regular store price. And then the last edited time that is done for you. Um, and that just, helps me to know um, how recent a price is and I find that to be useful. So the number one thing that I love about this versus spreadsheets is that when I search, I'm going to type in sauce, we'll do sausage links. It pulls everything up and just those items. It doesn't, you don't have to jump around and try to remember, oh, how much was that per unit? How much was that per unit? Did that one use ounces and this one use pounds? You don't have to remember that. It's all just right here. You can focus on just what you want to see. So we can look at celery. If I can spell it correctly. <laughs> okay. And here we've got all of the celery prices I've recorded. And you'll note one of these is per each instead of per pound. Um, this was one that I caught that, um, this particular thing of celery is probably only half a pound. And so that is an awful price <laughs> for celery. Um, that was one of the things I caught. I thought I was getting the best deal and I was not. So, um, the board view, you're not going to use this as often. But this um, puts all of your prices that you've entered for each store in alphabetical order. So if you're only going to one store, you could see all those prices together and um, plan your shopping trip that way. So that is pretty much it. I'm going to have the link to this listing in my Etsy store in the description box. Um, or you can find me on Etsy at Dixieland Oki Designs. Um, now, I don't normally do this, but I'm going to ask you to do me a favor because this would save a lot of money, especially in the long run on groceries. So I'm going to ask you to do me this favor and share this video or my Etsy listing with your friends because I want this to help as many people as it can. All right. <laughs> Thank you for watching this little demo. Um, go forth and save um, and hugs and blessings. Bye.